Hi friends and welcome here. We are going to do another grocery haul. We went to Sam's Club, we went to Trader Joe's and what else? Oh no, I think that was it. Yeah, this time we did not go to Publix. And on stopping by tomorrow, which is going to be Sunday, to Whole Foods to pick up a few dressings because we are going to have some company over. So I want to have a few dressings for them to pick from and also for us here at home to just have throughout the coming weeks. And also really quick, actually before we start, I should let you guys know that I have started a new Instagram page just for all the recipes and food that I am eating and I thought that that would just be much much easier for you and for me to just go back to and look through if you're looking for a specific recipe. It's a lot easier to pull it up and see the ingredients, see the recipe and go ahead and, and make it. So I will link that down below for you if you're interested in following me on there but now let's for sure get started on the grocery haul. Okay so to start off we got this three pack of um, unsweetened almond milk. Victor's been adding these to smoothies and it's actually pretty affordable. It's a three pack, half gallon for $8. And we got some tomatoes. This is for sandwiches. And I made um, homemade beans yesterday in the Instant Pot. And I wanna make like a pico de gallo to go on top of it. So I got some more tomatoes. You guys know I love my strawberries. So I got another pack of strawberries. These are so delicious and they last the whole week. They stay fresh. So, so far I've been loving the Sam's Club produce. And also got some bananas. I have found though that with bananas here in Florida, I don't know if it's just uh, like here, but even though they're green, they won't actually turn yellow. They end up spotting before actually turning yellow, which is so weird to me, but have to make sure that I eat them uh, before they turn like that, which is great though, I guess, because if they get spotted, then I just make uh, frozen bananas and can have some more smoothies. So either way, it's a win. And also got some, uh, some mushrooms because Victor has been enjoying mushrooms with a scramble. So he's been having that for his lunch and sometimes for his breakfast. So we got some of those because he's, like I said, been enjoying those. And Victor has gotten me into the habit of eating more salads. So this time, instead of picking up one romaine package, we picked up two and we actually went through it. And I had to tell myself like, okay, I'll let Victor have the last one. So I didn't eat a salad yesterday, but salads for the win. It's working. I'm trying to eat more, even if that means adding a little dressing that has a little bit more oil. It is okay. Just trying to get some more greens in. And let's see. We also got a bag of avocados. I really actually enjoy the avocados from um, Sam's Club. They're, they're big and they ripe up pretty well. And then we also got a big bag of red onion. We find that we use this a lot more than even white onion or yellow onion. And also we got some cucumbers just to snack on, but then also for toppings for sushi bowls because I do plan on making some sushi bowls this week. And I should note, we also got some a giant bag of frozen strawberries, but those are in the freezer because they were melting because those were the first thing that we got. And now on to Trader Joe's. At Trader Joe's, we got some chopped spinach. Uh, Victor's been throwing this in with his scramble. So we got two of these. And also, I have found, y'all know that I love my Wildwood Tofu, but um, it is $5, which isn't too bad, but we have it so often that I wanted to see if I could find another, another tofu that's uh, cheaper. We found this one at Trader Joe's, and it's like $2.60, something like that. And it's just as good. It's firm, which is why I like it. And so we picked up a lot because Victor's been having those daily and so have I for the most part. And for Victor's salads, he has been enjoying adding some hemp seeds to it with some, you know, just his dressing. So we got that for him. And as for dressings, we got some of this vegan Caesar dressing. I've actually, I think I've had it once before and I wasn't a huge fan, but hey, I'm gonna try it again. And I also got this jalapeno sauce to try again for the bowls as an option for a dressing. And I did pick up this extra virgin olive oil to massage the kale that we picked up. And that's gonna be for when we have company over this week. And I'm going to add a, just a tiny bit of, of oil, uh, massage it, and then add some spices and seasonings. 
and that's also because come on let's be real like not everybody eats uh oil free and quite honestly i mean for the most part yes i cook oil free but i don't shy away from adding a tiny bit if i need to or if i want to add a little bit of a different flavor to it okay so here's the last thing that we got we got this fruit and vegetable wash and it helps to remove waxes pesticides and chemicals so i want to try this out since we aren't getting as much organic produce anymore maybe this is going to be helpful for that and that is pretty much it it's our entire grocery haul for the week. We do have some fruits, some oranges, plums. I still have some leftover bell peppers and a bag of broccoli in the fridge. So I'm still going to be using those up as well. But this is what we bought to restock. And again, tomorrow I will be heading to Whole Foods to get a couple of more dressings uh, to be able to, yeah, just have here for when people come over. And that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Again, I will link down below the new Instagram page that's just for food. That's all you're going to see there. And I hope that you enjoyed the video. I hope that grocery hauls are helpful for you. And I will see you in the next video very, very soon. Bye!